That's how you keep your cowboy hat on while still maintaining music. Alright? If you don't know, you don't know. Just saying. You want to have the holographic hat? There's one thing you need to know. The camera on your phone is your enemy. It's going to knock your hat off. If you don't have the workaround, the screen recorder, you're going to have some problems. You're not going to be happy and you're not going to have a hat. So, I just wanted to say that. Because I wanted my fucking hat. So, I'm, I got it. Now I'm in this damn house doing some weird ass shit. New level, new devil. What you mean? Get on a new level of something to fight. You got a whole nother devil to fucking tackle when you do it. And who is it? It's always you. Your ego. I swear to God. I'm going to take a mo moment. This is a challenge for me. My buddy, my roommate. And I'm going to tell you why. Because, um... I'll just say... All people really, I've not been able to find anyone that this isn't the case, at least in my own living. I'm sure there's people that I know without having met, like famous or have channels wise that I could probably start the list and say they haven't done this when I'm about to say. But everybody, almost, pretty much, everybody I know in some sort of way is doing some sort of technical spying, but mostly, if it's not, they're doing it and they're pretending they don't know what they're doing. Um, that may be, that may be the case, but they are definitely doing it. I don't know what you'd have to do to spy. I can only guess because I don't I don't use my phone to spy on people and what this is what I'm trying to say. There's too much equipment and stuff like that. The I perceive something that I know I'm experiencing it. I don't think there's anything I can do about it, but it does piss me the fuck off. It does. Because there's like all these things that could be um, helpful to be uh, done or opened up. And because this weird, stupid communication barrier regarding man with cats, people that have animals like this, this, it's because they don't like people. They don't interact well with people or um, they might only interact with them on the most um, intellectual or mental way. And they sort of get the rest of their extra um, emotional life out of their animals. I, I'm just saying. You, a lot of times you see it, and it's a good thing when it's somebody that, like, needs to read to a dog to help them read or, you know, the service animal is helping you because you were wounded. That's, that's great. I don't have any problem with that. There's a lot of other relationships that are very similar to that, that um, humans are currently 
engaged in that's that's pretty much I'm cool with that like this one this see this lady cat I don't like her and I told her because she's all meowing and acting like she's talking to me and weird shit she was she's just completely weird and I tell her it's like look I don't like you I don't know what to tell you lady cat I'm like but I've got to pretend that you're you're fucking you're an angel you're down here you're fucking grading me on if I'm gonna be able to do it because I should be able to treat her like she's the creator too and I'm having difficult time doing it well you think I you, you think you think it would not be difficult I mean I told her that I don't know if she knows but if she is an angel and she's testing me and watching me that's the best way for me to get my ass into gear too because uh I don't, I don't, I don't like her. I start to like her, but she's done too much weird shit um, at the wrong time for me. So it doesn't look very good for either one of us to be very useful. I put that thing down there for her because I know she likes to sleep on it. But then she just tries to run into my room the first chance she gets. And I don't want her in there because she, she pukes on the floor. You know, and, and I'm not cleaning it up. And as you see, it's right here. Not that I care that much about it, because I really don't. But it's like, I didn't want to have to have that in my life. Period. You know what I mean? Like, why would you double down on having cats with that type of shit if you didn't have the cats? I don't understand it. I don't. I wanted to ask that when my other friends came over, because... It was the perfect time, and I thought I thought it would be too weird to put the person in the same weird um, stressed uh, crunch. If I'd asked him and put him on the spot, that's how I feel almost all the time. But I open myself up to a small degree of those types of experiences to transform them, you know? So, what are you going to do about it? You know? That's the pad. That's what I chose to do. I don't know if it's... It seems to be very useful, but... It does cause some horrible experiences. Because there's a lot of motherfucking gang stalkers that... Are just fucking paying attention and doing weird shit. They're into some weird shit. I don't know what it is. What it is. I'm not... Now, but uh, hold on. I'm kind of pissed because I, I, there is somebody I can almost say it has to be him. Or what, what's the fucking, what's the next thing that you could have go on? Somebody's moving my shit around and there's also cigarette butts appearing in my room and I don't smoke anymore. So these are like new, fresh smoked all the way cigarette butts which you know even when they're if they're new you can still tell you know what i mean so there's manipulation of shit weird shit you know and i'm like do i really have to worry or fucking wonder about that i don't i don't really care but like you always have this shit going on and it never fucking it never stops it never stops. You never find somebody that's just fucking right, not gonna, you know, do some weird ass shit, even if you know them. Another thing too is like he didn't he did not get this. Um like okay. One day, we were playing, he was playing his game, or he wanted to play his game. I'm high as hell. I'm doing my own shit. But I'm also trying to coax him into playing the game in here and getting into it. But I don't want to be, I don't want to have to be instructed how to he plays the game and all the stuff about that. I'm not interested in that. And I was like... I was like, dude, do you not know 
how much of a fucking gravity well you have on your ego. Like, and it was like, and he's, he is this way. Like if I go off and I was doing, and I like to tune my instruments because that's a big part of how I get my sound the way it is. Um, I have to crawl into it, you know, and he'll hear the noise or something like that. The things that uh, are involved in that type of situation normally are so modified by the stress that I've actually got a way to use it. I can, I can use it. I can position my shit and I do it. And I put my, I reposition my amplifiers and then my drums, the pieces of the drums. But like, I, I'm listening and I, I'd rather, I'd rather him and like Rich, Richard play. Although I play a lot. He doesn't want, when he plays, uh, most of the time is spent bitching about something's not working or some problem. And I'm like, dude, I'm like, if you heard, then why don't you sing? You know, if I have to hear somebody saying fuck and cussing and all that shit, can't you just switch over to maybe singing? You know, I don't know if I'm getting the point across. The point is what I'm trying to say is the like, you want to make music. You want to be creative. You know, you got the same output of volume coming out, but it's like, fuck. And he's bitching about all of his stuff because something will always end up being wrong with it. You know, I'm like, fuck that. You know, sometimes I'll plug my shit no, in. No, I am. I'm like, I've fuck got that. And then I've got I, wireless. I, also, um, I don't want to hear plugs to every plug, goddamn detail. My, um, of your fucking guitar. input coming from but your But I eyes. walk around with this. Don't tell me sometimes everything your eyeballs saw on the way though. to the store. But what the hell do I need that for? I listen to it. I'm trying to get rid of information I can't use. I don't need more of it. And God my damn, environment people. that I'm in is all the other thing I need. Other than Did I tell you what happened to me today? Please don't. Please don't. Say fuck you, you know to I my guitar. You ever had that I, this is brainstorming. Shouldn't make a song out of that. Fuck! Something's wrong with my knobs. both good at stuff and neither one's the boss we could just abide right no sure we could no Live in a man's world, men need problems to solve. They usually they get them from women and such. Cause women's got something that we like, so we know. That's the thinking about a song that sounds like this. Bro, you're a fucking hoto. You've always been a hoto. What I'm trying to say knows. might cause a deeper rift. Something in our soul we may not need. Be able to do it ourselves. Super good. With the school, you poor bitch, pitching back in. Nothing's changed, my friend. You're a fucking hotel. It'll be alright, though, right? 
They'll pick up on the clues. They will not pick up. You can make a face. You can throw your arms up. And you can think very loud in your mind. Stop telling me these things. They'll never catch on, though. I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure First I thought What the fuck How can you be so emotionally Fucking Ignorant Your emotional intelligence isn't You can't What the fuck Can't you see you're Boring me Can't you see I'm having a hell of a time You're making it Hell for me wanted to break you into a moment in my life. I wanted to show you part of my process. That's my process. That's how I do it. Now, I don't necessarily mean my friends a hoto. It's not what I mean. So, you can see there is a problem with the the song if, if it's too accurate. But, you know what? That just might be what the world needs. 